Hello everyone, Dom here and in this video I'm going to talk about the new Cubasis 3.7.5 update. This update is entirely free for all Cubasis users and it brings an amazing new feature to Cubasis for the first time. DO project support. With DO project format support, Cubasis now allows you to seamlessly exchange projects back and forth between Cubases, Cubase, and other compatible DAWs that support the DO project format. So imagine you can start a project anywhere with Cubases for iPhone, iPad, smartphone, or tablet, and then move this project to your favorite DAW and keep working on your computer, or vice versa. Let me show you. So right here I have a beat that I've created in Cubasis from scratch and let's have a listen. So let me show you what we have right here. I have several MIDI tracks and I also have an audio track. If I open my mixer, you can see this is how my faders are set up and I also have some panning for my channels. Now, let's see what instruments we have here. The first instrument is our drum kit. And this is the hip hop kit from Hylian Sonic Selection, which is an in-app purchase. Next, we have our 808. And this comes from Neo FM, again, another in-app purchase. We have this cool plucky sound, a piano from Hallion Sonic Selection, a DX7 flute sound from FM Classics. Again, that's an in-app purchase that you can have in Cubasis. Then I have some drum chops. And as you can see, I've done some fade outs right here. And last but not least, I have some tremolo strings from Iconica Sketch. And if you notice, I'm also sending these violins to our reverb right here. Now, let's say I wanted to take this project and keep on working with it in Cubase, for example. Now we can do this by using the DAW project format. So all you need to do to export a DAW project file so that you can open it in Cubase is go to media and then hit share. And as you can see, now we have another option. We have Cubasis. This is going to export a Cubasis file that you can open on another device. But we also have DAW project, which is going to export a DAW project that we can open in any other DAW project compatible DAW. So let's click on this. And as you can see, we can airdrop it. We can save it to files. We can save it to Dropbox. And that's what I'm going to do right now. And it's that simple. Now, let's go into Cubase and let's open this DAW project file. Let me show you how we can import the DAW project inside Cubase. All you need to do is go File, Import, DAW project. I'm going to select a new folder. And I'm going to select the DAW project file that we just exported, which is this one, DAW project Cubases. I'm going to hit Open. And here we go. Now we have the same exact project that we started in Cubases right here in Cubase. And as you can see, my faders and panning are in the right position in the mixer, but also we have our audio here with the fade outs and all the instruments have translated. So let me show you, Hip Hop Kit 2, I open it, we have Hallion Sonic Selection there. If we go to the 808, the 808 sound comes up with FM Lab. And so is the pluck sound that we used, the piano, which is Hallion Sonic Selection, the flute, that's a ROM sound from DX7 from FM Lab, and last but not least, our violins, which is Iconica Sketch. This have translated as well. And as you will see right here, we also have the reverb send assigned, and we also have our reverb send channel right here with our Roomworks reverb. Now imagine this, 
Let's say I want to add a vocal to this beat and then I want to go on the road again and keep working with Cubases. Let's do this right now. So I just added a vocal and I did a few chops right here, as you can see. Let's listen to it. Now let's take this project into Cubases. And that wasn't possible before, by the way. All I need to do is go File, Export, Door Project, just like we did with Cubases. I just need to name the project. I'm gonna name it Cubase Door Project with vocals, and I'm gonna hit Save. And I like to save all the Door Project files on an online storage service like Dropbox, Google Drive, or iCloud. Now we're going to go back into Cubases and open this Door Project file to keep working in Cubases on the road. Okay, now I worked in the studio and I want to go back on the road, but I want to take this project with me with the new elements that we added with this vocal. The only thing I need to do is go to Cubases and then click on Import. And now I can choose Files. And as you can see, I've saved the Cubase DAW project file right here. I can click on it and I can just open it. Now, if I click on media, the file will appear in our projects. And you will see it has a different icon. This is the DAW project icon, Cubase DAW project with vocals. So let's open this. And there you go. We just opened the DAW project file in Cubases. And as you can see, the vocal that we added in Cubase is right there. So you have complete freedom. You can start a project in your DAW on your desktop and then continue in Cubases on your iPhone, on iPad, on tablet and smartphone and keep working wherever you are. Right now, the DOP project format is supported by Cubase, but also Bitwig Studio and Presonus Studio One. Cubase's 3.7.5 is available as a free update. Download and enjoy.